Praise the Lord, everyone. This is Pastor Rodney coming to you again with more instruction from God's Holy Word and your today's drive-by. Yeah, listen, I want to talk to you all tonight and just let you know about tonight's Bible study, live Bible study at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Facebook Live. You know, I've had so many people come to me and say, Pastor, it seems like every time I try to put one foot forward, something else seems to pop up. And so I have a question. Have you ever been in a situation where it seems like you keep jumping from fight to fight, from battle to battle, from trouble to trouble, from temptation to temptation, and just when you think you have everything under control, something comes out of left field? Well, you know, tonight we're going to talk about why those things happen and, and how we, the people of God, can deal with the various stresses of life. We know that the Word of God says that those that want to live godly must suffer persecution. But, you know, it's sometimes when these things come, you know, it's not that we can't handle them, but it's just that sometimes it's like we're looking for a break. We're looking for just a reprieve, like, you know, just a moment of rest. It seems like it just comes back to back to back. And even, you know, not just outside of us, but even inside of us, the temptations of our flesh, you know, that seems to keep plaguing us over and over and over again. And it's like, you know, the more that it happens, it seems like we feel like we're getting weaker and we have to submit to it or we have to give in to it. But tonight, I want to share with you something that the Word of God says on this subject and how we, the people of God, can handle those back-to-back -back battles, you know? How you can deal and fight with things that happen back-to-back -back and from all sides. And so, join me tonight at 10 p.m. Tell your friends about it. Post this on your page and as well as send it to some other friends and encourage them to join with us at 10 p.m. tonight, Eastern Standard Time. Um, God bless you. I love you real good in the name of our Lord. Have a blessed and marvelous day in Jesus' name.